Hello and welcome to Zamora Gaming. I'm your host, Joe Zamora here, and I am bringing you episode 5 of the Pokemon Conquest series. Alright guys, so last episode, if you don't remember, we took down the water gym, or castle, I should say, and eh, pretty easy, and we realized we couldn't link Pokemon yet, so everything I was doing was all for naught, but you know, we'll figure it out here. So let's go ahead and we're going to take this team here to take on uh, Violite. Violite Castle, sorry. Violite is the kingdom ravaged by thunderstorms. Perhaps that's why there's so many electric type Pokemon here. It's a tough place for water type and flying type Pokemon. Ground type Pokemon are the best choice. But grass type Pokemon are also pretty strong against electric attacks. Yeah, well, we're taking. Well, they have a freaking bird. That's the problem. You know what? Let's take Carnivine. For sure. Oh, we gotta. We gotta. Okay, I see. I see now. Sorry, sorry. Alright, guys, y'all gotta move out of that kingdom for a little while. While I move every one of these guys over here. So come on to Greenleaf. And we don't want to leave this castle vacant, so we're gonna move you guys over here. To Ignis. All right. So, I mean, we have two people here. Let's march. Let's march. You over here, because we need to get that uh, trainer. We need to get that warrior. My bad. Wrong game. And we need to beat these water type Pokemon to a pulp. But first, let's go ahead and take on Violite. Alright, she already explained this to us. Choose your player. So this is what we're going with right here. Let's go to Violite, baby. I shan't lose. I sh shan't lose. The victory will be mine. Joe's army appears in Violite. Hell yeah, baby. Oh yeah, baby. Sing your song, dude. And I kind of wrote down the warriors now, so we're in a better shape there. So that's good for us. Alright, guys. The kingdom of Violite. So, you're Joe, are you? Hmm, I was wondering what you'd be like, and I have a, I have to conclude that you're no match for me and my Shinx. Ha! What's wrong? You, you're a child, talking like that to a warrior before you've even done battle. Fine, I'll stop talking and demonstrate my power on the battlefield instead. Oh! Oichi is very concerned. Joe's army versus Ginchios. I think that's how you say it. I could be wrong. On my honor. Yeah, on your honor, you're gonna lose, lady. We do not intend to lose. Alright, so she's very fierce. A uh, rar, as most people would say. So we're gonna go ahead and come this way here. And if you didn't recognize those buttons, they're color coded to where they will destroy your life. So we're just gonna kinda not do that. And chill in the empty spots. 
chill. Don't fight. Ooh, we almost made it all the way across, but I'm not going to risk it. Because turn one, that Pichu can go hit that button if it wanted to. Oh, yeah. See? Right there. Oh, gosh. Come on. Yeah, the game's lagging. Come on, game. Get it together now. Woohoo! Fight the system! So we're gonna go ahead and come this way. With that. Let's see, Shanks, are you in range? Of course you are. But we shan't uh, worry about that, I guess. It's time to do battle. Let's go ahead and get uh, as many Pokemon as we can out of harm's way. Because we don't want to get hit for no reason. And this should pretty much do a lot of damage to my Charmander and Daramaka over here. But we'll see. We'll see what it decides to do. So we got the Mareep over here giving us a critical hit on the first turn. Oh, that sucks. Okay, Shinx decides to come out and do some damage. Ooh, a mighty 14 power. Jesus Christ. Come on, game. Stop freaking glitching out. Okay, so Pan Sage is going to come over here and try to do some work on us. Five damage. It's pretty good. Alright. Starly is also going to do some damage to us, and that's ten. Holy crap. Our, our uh, Charmander is getting pretty beat up over here. Yep. And that's going to take it out. Oh no, it sets a blaze. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and do the damn thing to this Pichu over here. For doing so much damage to our friends. So that thing's going down. Oh, well, I guess not quite yet. And let's see, Carnivine can breach, and it does some damage as well. Okay, so far so good. It's not the perfect matchup that we were hoping for, but it does, it's doing something. So we're going to raise our defenses since that water gun can do some pretty good damage. And we're going to go ahead and hit this, uh, Mareep. Ooh, with the critical hit. Beautiful. Alright, let's back out here. And let's see, Detox. Okay, cool. So now we can move the Charmander. And we're going to get some good damage off on the Starly. Boom, baby. And we're going to back off over here. Because we don't want to get hit unnecessarily again. <clears throat> and I would sweet song. But I don't feel we really need Charmander that badly. Oh, man. Whew. Game almost glitched out on me for a minute. And it's been a second since I saved. So let's hope that doesn't happen. Genchio's okay so it dropped our accuracy a bit Mareep's gonna go attack our Eevee which you know seems fitting Pan Sage uh, probably believes we, we it's got damage on us oh and attack boost 
Doesn't quite do enough, but it does sit on that power button again. And gives his own Pokemon a good jolt. Come on, game. Tough it out for one more video. Ooh, and 20 damage and another paralysis. This is not good for us. Ooh, most powerful hits. 16 damage. And let's see what this Pansage does. 26 damage, even with our defense boost. Alright, we need some luck on our side, and we don't get it. Oh, that would have been so useful there. So we're going ahead and take out the Pichu, which is good for us. Ooh, and Celebrate lets us go again. So I guess we'll just go ahead and hit up on this Mareep and take it out, of course. Oh no, we missed! The interference made a difference. Alright, let's see how much damage we can do here. Okay, so 22 max. Our defense is raised. Can we get 8 damage? No, not even close. So we're just going to go ahead and hit this Mareep over here. So Mareep, it gets burned. Beautiful. We needed some luck on our side. Alright, so we can get behind this Pansage. And do 24 damage. Which is better. So we're going to go ahead and smack that thing up pretty good. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and go for We're gonna go for a potion. I think our other Pokemon are still pretty good on health. But the two hard hitters are trying to knock us out, so we're gonna come this way. And let's go ahead and get some damage off on this Shinx. Let's hit it five times, no? Oh, well, I guess uh You win some, you lose some. But let's go ahead and move that thing there so we can probably get a leg up on that thing oh so close so close we are in a great position to win this match and he does block off the pan sage from hit I mean pan poor from hitting us but does not block off the shanks which is okay it ignites our blaze Oh, come on, game. We're almost there. Oh, and Pampor decides to go f against Jigglypuff with that hit. Very interesting move. Oh, very smartly played. Alright, so that thing gets hit there. Let's go ahead and come over here, hit the Shinx. And that's going to take it out. Don't miss. Critical hit. We for sure took it out at that point. So celebrate. We get to move again. I mean, can't do much. So we're just going to kind of sit. No, not there. We're going to sit here. All right, we're going to take a step back. Gather our thoughts here. Hit that thing. Come over here. Get a good smack up on this thing. Vine Whip takes out at least one Pokemon. Alright, we're going to Sweet Song here. To help out all of our Pokemon. And there's not much else I can do with this thing except come this way. But it looks like we will be taking over the castle of Violite if all goes well here. So Starly is going after our Eevee. Not the wisest decision, I think. But, you know, all fools make horrible decisions every now and then. 
the Mareep decides to go after our Jigglypuff here. Oh, and it almost goes down to burn. Where is this going to hit? Don't hit me, please. Woohoo! So close. We lucked out that time. So it appears Jigglypuff is going to be paralyzed for two turns. Which is no fun for our Pokemon, that's for sure. Uh, let's see, what can we do here? What can we do for a Klondike bar? We can knock out this Mareep. And get some decent damage off on the Starly. So that works out in our favor. Let's go ahead and at least get this prize box. And let's see if we got the damage output to do here. No, we don't. We don't quite take out the Starly, even with the buffed hit of two extra hit points. And it decides to give itself some health. So it does go after... Oh, it goes after our Carnivine, but it doesn't do quite enough damage. And Darmok is finally going to get a hit off. And of course it's going to be the winning hit here. Beautiful, beautiful play. And we beat the Violet Castle. Violet Castle is ours, and I'm going to take a victory water break. Alright, we getting it. Look at those links. That's power right there. We got extra, extra link percentage. Jesus, especially Carnivine. Look at that. Alright, so we can recruit two people here. We're going to go ahead and add them to our list. That was a fine contest. Firelight Castle is yours to use as you see fit. You don't mind? No, my conscience is clear. This battle did not bring shame upon our family name. We protected our honor, and that is all that matters. You got a lot of para hacks, that's for sure. But we got Sean. Or Sean. I don't know how you pronounce it. With a Pichu. And then we have Soren with Pansage. I mean Pampor. Everything's a Pansage apparently with me. Jesus Christ. So Pampor. Yes, we will accept both of you into our army. I would have accepted everyone. I'm very much obliged. Alright, let's move you to this one over here. I know yours is Mareep. I remember from the many times I've played this game. We did it, Lord Joe! Hey. You! We keep bumping into you! Looks like you've captured a lot of kingdoms now, huh? Surely you're not trying to run them all by yourself. Huh? But, but Lord Joe is the warlord, the leader of our army. Being a warlord is more than just doing battle, you know. Now, you can choose what goes on in your kingdoms in your absence. Or instead, you can delegate control all of the kingdoms to all another warrior. It's gonna be training! That's the best way to spend your time. Tisk, I think searching for warriors and Pokemon is more important. Much more important. Ha, huh, you two never think ahead. You won't get anywhere unless you develop your army. But it's up to you, of course. Just be sure to give us give it some thought, okay? Alright, so we can officially delegate now, which is good. It's better than what we had. And I'm gonna go ahead and figure out these two guys' links. So Sean and Soren. Shown and Soren, Shown and Soren. Yep, guys, you gotta deal with me with this. Again. 
all the way through until we catch them all. I do plan on 100% in this list. Okay, so Soren. Soren has a pan port, but he needs a Pichu, Pikachu, Raichu. And then. Shown. We're almost done with one page. Ooh, my bad. So, Shown, where you at, Shown? You need. Just show me where you're at, <clears throat> first of all. I found Shigazine. Shigazine. Not shown. It's not showing shown. Where are you at, fool? I need to fill your Pokemon thing. Good Lord Almighty. Shown, shown, shown. I'm gonna kick you in your shins. Where the hell is this guy? Where the hell is this guy? Well, didn't find him that time. Maybe he's the one guy that's blocked off. I think so. Alright, well I'll figure him out in a minute. But we can officially say... Oh, it's been officially saved. Okay, let's go ahead and delegate our other armies here. Jesus Christ, this game is glitchy. But I'm going to delegate to search because you kind of train and gain people at the same time. And that's what we want to do. Alright, let's go ahead and delegate them to search as well. Alright, warriors have completed their task. So neither of them actually accomplished anything. Which is fine, I guess. Oichi. Look, Lord Joe, isn't that... Kiji. Hey, it's you again. Never thought I'd see you here. What do you think of this kingdom, then? Well, it's quite far from Aurora, and there are lots of Pokemon here that we've never seen before. There sure are. You should link with some of them and make them your partners. Oh! But, but we have Eevee and Jigglypuff. Sure, but don't you want to try to get to know some other Pokemon? Everyone's got their own perfect partner. By which I mean a Pokemon with whom you can form a perfect link. R really? Really, really? Yes. Just remember that the number of Pokemon partners can have... Ugh. Just remember that the number of Pokemon partners you can have depends on your capacity. Anyway, I recommend you give some other Pokemon a try while you're here. Okay, now we can start linking Pokemon. And let's see how many Pokemon we can actually link up with. How many Pokemon are actually in our thing. Okay, Pokemon Conquest... Perfect links. We're gonna find this thing out real quick. That's not the app I use. Or website, I should say. Come on, phone. See, everything's lagging today. What the hell? There we go. Beacon. That is the website I use. Okay, so shown, shown me the money. All right, look up and his, yeah, Marie. I knew it. I just had to make sure. 
Now let's start getting these guys their perfect link. Alright, so we have this guy. He needs to go to the fire. Fire Kingdom. Alright, these guys need to go back to the Grass Kingdom. Ouch. Uh, let's see. Daramaka, go back to the Fire Kingdom. I mean, Grass Kingdom, sorry. Because <sighs> you're needed there. Um, let's see, Carnivine, you go to the Water Kingdom. And then, Tepig needs Venipede, so you can stay with me. Shone, you have a Pichu, but you need a Mareep. And the other guy has a pan pour but needs a Pichu, so you can stay with me as well. Ooh, that leaves the Fire Kingdom pretty wide open. But I think we will attack that kingdom next. Since we have range and, you know, Pokemon to help us out. Let's see. Oh, there's a wild Pichu and plenty of Pokemon to join our team here, so let's do that. So we're gonna get Panpour linked with that Pichu, and we're gonna kill everything else. <clears throat> Excuse me. Mood Maker. Okay, so basically just saying if a Pokemon has a gold or silver link depending on what the link uh, color is the better the link you can get with that Pokemon okay well that sucks so we get a miss we can't attack now everything's pretty blocked um, Tepig comes this way and I'm not trying to jump over there by myself so, Peachy stays over here. Alright, the Pichu I need falls right into my trap. Alright, so it gets a good amount of damage off on this Jigglypuff. Ekans jumps across. And Ralts gets some damage off on my freaking Tepig. So there's that. Ooh, Eevee's feeling good. Let's go this way. Let's go ahead and try to take out this Rolts. It does some decent damage. Now we will do some damage to this Rufflet. Because Rufflet would be very good on our team for that uh, fighting type gym. Oh, let's go ahead and get... A tad bit closer. Get some damage on this Ekans. It's going to double attack into us, but that's fine. We kind of want that. Let's go ahead and get over here. Get some flame damage off on this thing. And let's get this perfect link. Yeah, this game is ready to give up on us, guys. Alright, watch as the linking lights flow towards you. Press A button as soon as you link. Yep, okay, so basically it's just a little mini game. Press A every time you want it, the link to get closer. Yep. Okay, almost there. Give me more. Yes, we linked! The Pichu is mine. Let's accompany one another, Pichu. Pichu! 
All right, we got the Pichu. Beautiful. Now all we gotta do is achieve our other goal of killing all these Pokemon. Good God, come on. You're, you're linking slowly. All right, Ninjutsu is here and he's gonna, oh, goes for the Jigglypuff. All right, Moonmaker makes us stronger. I guess we can just come this way then. Oh my God, this game's lagging so bad. You can tell by the music. All right, let's get this attack up. All right, guys, and as this video is coming to an end, I would like to remind you guys to leave a like, subscribe, and share videos where you can. If you want to catch me doing some live streams, I do live streams on Facebook. Link is in the description below. Everything you need to check me out, it's there. So go ahead and do that, guys. It really helps out the channel. <clears throat> And gives me more time to, you know, do videos like this. Oh, man. This Ekans is a pain. Alright, let's see. <laughs> the game, like, speeds up and then slows down big time. Okay, let's come over here. Do some good damage. Thunder, hell yeah. Get some chip damage off right there. Uh, that's not gonna do enough damage. That's not gonna do enough damage either. Jesus. Let's see. How much damage does that do? Clearly not enough. Let's go ahead and take this thing out. And then Rufflet will be the last Pokemon we have to worry about. And at least Ekans won't lower our attack anymore. So down goes Ekans here. Oh, I get to go again, actually. And let's go ahead and knock out this thing. That way Jigglypuff can uh, potentially lullaby this thing. And get some good damage off as well. Because damage is what we need on this thing. And uh, possibly Peach could take this thing out. Oh yeah! Critical hit! Oh, he didn't like that critical hit. Moonmaker! It's making Tepig happy. Let's go ahead and go this way. Get as much gold as we can on the way out. And for sure, if we don't knock it out, Pichu will. But we do. And we should have been able to get everyone in just enough time. So we recruited many more Pokemon to our party. Oh, and we don't get the Rufflet. But we do get the Psychic type and the Poison type. So that's good for us. Okay, so Akizane... Akizan, I guess, with the Nekins. Oh, yeah, what am I doing? Yes, I want them both. And then I gotta get the other one. 
with the roots. Saizo. And I will try to do some partner Pokemoning off screen. But if I do get linked up in a battle, uh, I just might start up the recording just to add on to this episode. Or maybe at the beginning of the next episode. But we will see. But thank you guys for watching. Again, go ahead, leave a like, subscribe where you can. And don't forget to follow on Facebook. That's where I need the followers the most. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.